Hey, hey, thanks for tuning in to Motorhead. Well, you know what? I had a choice. Either pay 50 something dollars to get one from Europe, a fan shroud, or wait and just get my $17 one that I already paid for. So, no date. They don't know when it's going to come in. Used to be um, like mid June or first part of June, but now they don't even know. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna put the fan in. So what we have here is, you know, me sharing you my little Jerry rig, and you know I don't know if I recommend this, but to get it going, I'm doing it. And basically, I removed. And I want to show you guys. You know what? I may put it back. I'll run it and I'll see. But right now it seems to be really solid the way I did it. And it's temporary. I mean, maybe, you know, who knows? Two, three weeks, four weeks. I don't know when they're going to get the part in. But here's the old one. So this plugged in. It has a wire and a plug back there. It plugs in. And then there's two pins that come in right here. Okay. See if I can get a little bit better light on this thing for you guys. But there's a couple pins, part of the radiator frame that these tabs slot into. And then this walks forward in that screw right there. That's what screws into this hole. Okay, so you got a plug, plugs in, this thing goes. Okay. So, what I did, I screwed one, I found a screw in my screw box, pulled one out, right thread, threaded that in there, secured the fan to this. There's a rod that comes down that keeps the fan from hitting the blades. That's the whole idea. I got this in without hitting the blades at all. Um, I zip tied, I used zip tie through the other eyelet down here and uh, ran it through one of the frame holes you know underneath here see if we can get to take a look but there's one so and there's the other frame hole i don't know if you can see it guys i'm going to try to do you good but um that's it so i ran the zip tie through the frame hole for the pin hole and then the eyelet three eyelets on the fan itself so you know one screw there solid hit perfect and then this floats so it all floats I don't know if you can see that but you can see airspace all the way to the other side I don't know if you can see it but um, it's, it's a little closer that way than it is this way so pay attention there um, if you ever decide to venture right but that's what I did. And then the back zip tie, it had a it had a wide loop, you know. I didn't like that, so I took two smaller zip ties and I pinched the one zip tie in the back holding it in place. And this thing is <laughs> pretty solid. All right, so I'm, I'm pretty happy with it, actually. You know, now is the zip tie is going to break. Okay, so um, anyway, and I'm not going over like, you know what, if you're going over a rough road, man, I don't know, man, don't even think about it and uh, I really don't recommend doing this but I'm going to show you how much air is blown out of this thing okay and that's it's actually sucking where this fan okay blows air that way so when you're cruising down the road it's kind of okay so that's why these flaps are here so when you're cruising down the road it'll evacuate the air right otherwise it's going to do a pretty good job while you're sitting at a light okay good fan though it's done done me good especially with the smart motor fan switch but with this and the lower thermostat thermo switch i don't think i'll ever need to use the smart motor fan switch and i'll be able to use it though for this demonstration here but um other than that if this thing's working properly you won't need the smart motor fan switch Okay, so let's try it. 
I tried it once and I will now I want to show you so here we go it's blowing a lot harder all right it, but instead of instead of blowing this way it's sucking air back this way and it's moving a ton of air across the engine here and as you're going down the road it's going to make it better not worse um, look forward to the shroud you know it's going to make it even better because it's going to take up probably some more gaps here come around here be safer you know i mean this is this is dangerous so i don't recommend doing it to any you know but we'll see what it looks and see what it does okay here we go so it's way back here air is just and then here it's just sucking pretty good so so anyways um look forward to using it what i want to see is if it's cooling the water faster and the fan is running less and if it's that way and i'm going to check it out and then go from there about maybe putting it back until my shroud comes in i don't know but uh hey thanks for watching